My name is Leisha and I'm an electric pop artist from Galway. I'm Zoe from Dreaming of Jupiter. My name is Johnny Stewart and I write, record and perform music as a wolf with two Fs. Hello, uh, my name is Deborah Byrne and I'm a singer, songwriter, producer and one half of Electronic Duo Hummingbird. I am a musician uh, who rambles way too much in between songs on stage. I think the one thing I wish I knew when I started out in music is that you can't really do everything yourself and that other people can help you. Looks aren't that important. <laughs> Never do anything you don't want to do to try and impress other people. I think when I started out in music, I spent way too much time prepping for gigs in the wrong way. Like I'd go get my hair, my makeup done, get someone else to pick out my outfit. And then I was like performing not as myself. And then I did a total fucking 180 and uh, started playing in uh, the same shirt every day. Yes, there's no rush and that a lot of the pressure that we feel is self-imposed. Um, so try and relax a little bit and enjoy it more. I wish I knew how important it is to have patience when you work in the music industry. There were some times where I thought that I had to do everything myself because um, it was my work and it was my art. When really this, it's just so much more beneficial to share the experience with other people because the more people that become involved, the more of a team you have. Um, and the more, the more fun it's going to be. You can get kind of caught up in saying this is my whole thing, this is my only thing. And uh, bringing other people into the situation is, just makes it so much more worthwhile. You should always create out of a place of loving what you do. And then if anybody else enjoys it, it's a bonus. <laughs> but it's comfy, like, do you know what I mean? Fantasy. I'm really nerdy about guitar pedals and harmony. I love a good spreadsheet. Yeah. Jack of all trades, master of none. On my videos, my photos, and my design, I will invest a lot of time and energy into making sure they look the best they possibly can. Visuals, color, and things like that. I spend a lot of time messing on Photoshop and Final Cut Pro, even though a lot of the stuff I do is basic, but I kind of like that. If you have the best sounding music in the world, but when people go onto your website or your Facebook page or your Instagram account and they don't like the look of your photos and your videos and your design, they won't even give you the chance to click on your link and listen to your music because they think you sound bad because you look bad. So I take a lot of pride in making sure that I look the best I possibly can in anything to do with my artist branding. I'll always put off her. Uh writing about myself as an artist. I hate the thoughts of writing a biography. I don't want to give you 500 words on my story as an artist. I don't want to describe my music in 100 words or less. I feel as a musician it is a pointless exercise anyway because the reason I write music is to express myself. So that just adds to the sort of anxiousness I feel when someone tells me I have to do this. Replying to people in time. Clean in my room. Shopping. It is the least appealing thing in the world. I usually put off doing my washing. I always put off, put off the, the biggest, vaguest, you know, thing on my to-do list that I'm not particularly skilled at. So, for example, our website sat there for about a year on my to-do list instead of me actually just detailing out exactly what needs to be done. Because, as always an admin, the thought of doing something is much worse than actually doing it. And I'll always put it off until the last minute and then just not be happy with what I wrote anyway. Things, all the things probably podcasts. Gathering up clothes, putting them in the washing basket, but not actually washing the clothes. Social media. And who doesn't want to watch loads of YouTube videos? Uh, YouTube videos. This fantasy. Um, copy. Copy. My best admin fuel is food, which I'm doing right now. The best admin fuel for me is just knowing that if I don't do it, it will not get done. I find having admin dates is handy. I, I like working with other people and um, being in a like clear, bright space that's really quiet and really good Wi-Fi. 
Otherwise, I would just be thinking about food the whole time. That's not to say that I, I always do it. More time or more money? More time or more money. I don't think you'll find many musicians who wouldn't ask for more money. Um, but I'm quite time rich, so I'm pretty thankful for that. Definitely more time. I think it's much more important to have more time than more money. I'll take the time to figure it out and to do it. Um, rather than just, I, I don't know, there's, there's a laziness in me that always would want to get somebody else to do things for me. Um, and in that you could you would end up paying them for it and you'd end up paying a lot of expenses that you don't need to. Kind of more time. There's a lot of ways to get around not having enough money but if you have mates that can do stuff for you or like help you out that, uh, that's great. As cliched as it sounds time is finite. I feel you can always earn more money by investing that extra time into doing something that would help you earn money. Um, the old adage, more money, more problems, seems to ring true here. I think if you have more money, you're just going to probably employ people to do the work for you that you would do, but I really enjoy doing the work. Um, it's very rewarding, whether it be you know, recording your own videos or taking your own photos or doing your own design or recording yourself. It's very rewarding and I, I'm interested in it. So, you know, all the problems that I have as an independent artist, as a self-managed artist, I feel it would be solved more with time than with money. I'm running on this fantasy. Um, I'm a rambler and I can't explain anything. And if you were watching this and I've done that to you, I'm really sorry. It's your luck. But if you want to give me more money, I'll take it. <laughs>